Hi, this is Brian. I hope 2020 is off to a great start for you. Here at the Police Jury, we are kicking the year off with a new series showing examples of how our parish staff are living out our mission, vision, and values. This is the first in a series of videos that will be shown periodically that highlight what our departments and employees are doing and how this is making a great difference throughout the parish. Thank you for all your efforts to make the Calcasieu Parish Police Jury shine. If you want to share how you or others are living our mission, vision, and values, please reach out to Amina Porsche and Human Resources today. Thank you. I'm here to talk to you about our program, the new Leash on Life program that we have here that is partnership with the OJJS. The program is a program that we use to have an animal be selected from the shelter to go over to OJJS. The animal is then housed there at their kennels and taken care of, and they use these animals to um, help with their children there at their services to teach them responsibility. It's a very unique program that we partnership with uh, Animal Services. Uh, our goal was to try to adopt animals into our facility and, and put them back out in the community. So not only are we giving the, the youth a special opportunity to make a difference in the community, but also we assisting the animal and giving them a second chance on being a part of a family. Overall what happens is um, someone here, a staff person may find a dog or see a dog that seems like it might be easy to train and what we do is is we get out there and we have our adoption coordinators go take a look. Um, they give OJJS a call and speak to them and ask them are we ready for another dog? We have a dog here that has potential. Um, would you like to take a see the dog? They'll take photos and send them over. Um, they'll have their discussion and then they'll decide to send the animal over. We actually screen the youth. We do a staffing to determine that the, the youth wouldn't involve in any incidents that are, that are abuse, any type of abuse with animals. From that point on, we, we allow the youth to come out with the licensed trainer and allow the youth to try to grow a bond with the, with the animal. Uh, from that point on, the, the licensed trainer teach the youth basic obedience training that he have to do daily with the, with the animal. From that point on, he take a daily uh, responsibility on trying to uh, make sure that the dog do all the basic obedience training daily, and then from that point on, He's also responsible for the grooming uh, and all, all aspects of what the animal need on a day-to-day -day basis. I'd like to believe that the impact, of, especially for the children, is teaching them responsibility, compassion, love, and overall patience. Because you do have to have patience when you're dealing with an animal to take the time to train them to get them to do the things that you'd like for them to do. One of the benefits that, that's very important to me is the behavior of the youth. Uh, a lot of time when, when a youth come in, they're angry, they don't want to be here, uh, and, and at times those type of kids, we try to get them involved in this program because it, it shows them a form of compassion, not only for themselves, but for others. We even had an incident that a youth was so actively involved with, with one of the uh, animals we have over here that he wrote a letter to uh, the person that came out and adopted the animal. So uh, it's, it's very rewarding, uh, and it was so, it was so com it was so emotional at that point that it, it caused tears not only for myself, and I consider myself don't tear that often, uh, for others. Uh, a lot of kids, uh, actually by him growing so much attention into drawing so much attention toward the animal, other kids was wanting to get involved. This opportunity allows for both the OJJS and as well as Animal Services come together as one unit to agree and team up to allow a pet to go over to their facility and live there, be trained and learn and have the students there take care of it. And these are the core values of the parish as far as us being um, a unit and all together as one. Well. My name is Kevin Thomas and I'm Parish Proud. My name is Nicole Dumas and I am Parish Proud. <laughs>